I love you too. I'm sorry to block traffic. All right, thank you. God bless. Yeah, yes. Thank you. Sorry. What's up? More than you know, I feel blessed because this is my neighborhood. Central Ward, Newark, New Jersey. It is an incredible community of people. And uh, I feel lucky every time I get to come home from Washington, D.C. and be here. It's good. I live right here. Yeah, I know. You, you do? I, told I live you on that. Longworth. I've been told you yeah, that. Yeah, you seriously, just knock on my door if you need something. Really? I'm not, I'm not joking. Oh, this is, we got the selfie. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you, you all. Thank you. Thank you. All right, God bless. Some of the most shameful and, and difficult experiences of my life were running with the police when I was young and growing up. And what is painful to me to know is that that's not an exception, that most of the African-American men in particular that I know have had these awful experiences where they felt they were close to death. I'm confident that one day in this country we will ban religious and racial profiling. I am confident that one day in this country we will ban chokeholds. I am confident that one day in this country we will have a national registry of police misconduct, of police use of force. I am confident that one day no one who murders someone in broad daylight in front of cameras will be shielded from accountability on the federal level in our civil courts or in our criminal courts by impossible standards to meet. It is clear that one day we shall overcome what is now injustice. I want us to have a nation that I think everybody wants, from police officers uh, who wanted their profession uh, to really continue to uh, evolve to uh, uh, community leaders, we all want to have policing that's transparent, that's accountable, uh, and that has the highest of professional standards, and where we no longer in our nation see these regular videotapes of people uh, being treated in a discriminatory, violent manner by, by police. Um, this is something we all should yearn for, is a more beloved community where uh, all of us are working hand in hand uh, with trust and, and respect uh, to create a deeper safety uh, uh, in our communities, and that's what something I think we can accomplish. It's a blessing to see you, man. Thank you, man. Really You're a blessing to see you. Blessing, God bless you, man. Love that haircut, man. <laughs> All right. Thank you for taking care of people. God is empowering you to help others. I love that. I love that. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today to stay up to date with all the latest news.